Well, welcome back, everybody. Today I'm reacting to Hunter Hunter episode 10. Um, yeah, so episode 10, I am reacting to that today. Last episode, we had Gone Go. He handled that dude real quickly. And then we had Kurapika. He went as well. Um, he got he got his blood flowing, his emotions going, you know, because he saw that spider. And when he sees a spider, he's got that arachnophobia, you know, his eyes start glowing red. And once he saw that spider, he just took care of that guy immediately. So now we're going to have Leodio go. And my prediction is that Leodio is going to lose and then Kilo is going to go and then Kilo is going to win. So I just hope that Leodio puts up a good fight, which I'm sure he will. So let's jump into episode 10. Oh, yes. Yeah, sometimes I forget to mention this. Go to BitChute. shoot. My reaction will be there. And then come back here for the post discussion. All right. See you there. That was pretty good. That was a lot different than I thought that would be. But it ain't over yet. Leodio still has to go. But the whole episode wasn't about Leodio. We had a little bit of Hisoka. Um, I guess there was an examiner from the previous year who wanted to get revenge on him because he was responsible for giving him those scars. Um, so he was doing this quad infinite blade thing. It was pretty cool but Hisoka was just dodging them. That was actually really a cool scene, just seeing him dodge all these things. And then he caught two of them, and then he just... <laughs> Hisoka then went on to be the first one to finish the exam. Or finish getting to the, to the bottom of the tower there. That dude is crazy strong pretty ridiculous uh we got to see leodio go the next opponent was coming up and then she was like oh it's this but that match is not over yet because he is not dead he's just unconscious so they waited for hours because kurapika didn't want to kill the guy uh and then gone was like hey well he might be dead already so they wanted him they wanted them to check and they checked and they said he was still unconscious so they started betting and they bet on whether or not he was actually unconscious or they started betting on whether or not he was unconscious or if he was dead and then they bet on whether or not he was actually unconscious and so that whole scene was like it just wasn't what i what, what i was expecting but it was, it was um the guy was he was actually awake and so he was getting like the uh you could like hear him talking in his head and stuff. So Leodio was right about him not actually being unconscious because he picked up his body and said that he was going to throw him over the ledge. So that obviously scared the dude. All right, so we're not finished with Leodio's match. Um, he has the lead right now, so I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe he does win, but we will see in the next episode. So anyways, that's my reaction. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And of course, thanks for watching. See you next time. Peace.